going on guys Joe with omgrc.com so what we got going on is uh, the start of the one tenth scale garage so we got five bays that are here uh, this thing just kind of give you guys an idea this thing's 80 inches wide by 36 inches deep by 26 inches tall so it's pretty large and this is a one tenth scale RC vehicle that's in here so we, and we still have plenty of playroom back so um not <laughs> so you know this thing's pretty large uh okay so what i'm gonna be doing i'm not gonna do i'm gonna do this off camera anyhow but i'm gonna do i'm gonna start priming all the pieces up this is what i have an idea for the floor i'm not 100 percent sure how it's going to turn out so that's why i only grab two cans i'm like if just in case this doesn't work or whatever i don't even know if two cans will actually do this amount of surface anyhow and and i don't know if it sprays gray I don't know anything about it to be honest with you. I just like okay, I kind of like that little speckle to it because that's what some you know, I've done in garage before, and I did something like that. It looked like kind of speckle. It's a white uh, primer, so we'll see how this all kind of works out. But I'm pretty I'm pretty excited about it. Anyhow, I do have like the garage doors over here. So we got the five bay doors. So I'll, I'll probably you know there's a lot to this thing as far as paint colors or anything like that. I don't even know what color I want to paint it. I'm just gonna lay down as far as do the, the floor. Like I said, I'm gonna prime up a bunch of the little parts that are here anyhow. And then um, kind of work on it from there, get some other ideas. I'm trying to look at some other real garages and kind of get an idea of you know what colors, the grays, the red, and all the different stuff that's in there. I'm gonna put LED lights in it too. I already have some LEDs for it. So I'll put a strip in there, that way this thing can be all bright. I'll probably automate it or so, so I can turn it off and on that way and then as far as the logo so i want to do the logo so we got this little header here for the building it's about eight inches tall if i'm not mistaken and uh, i want to get a logo that lights up there i would love to have since our bay doors o m g r c close the doors down and it spells it out there as well that'd be kind of cool so you guys let me know what you think about that but um yeah it's a uh, big it's heavy and at least it comes apart as of now i did notice like you know this thing is on a nice flat surface because this is mdf and it's still yeah there's some of it needs to, i feel like it needs to be glued down or so i'm not 100 percent sure but it is nice if i can take it apart because if i want to move it do whatever i kind of like it on this table to be honest with you too but uh, i just want to kind of share you guys share you share this with you guys sorry um just kind of give you a little bit of insight what was going on but i think it's pretty cool i do like it and i can put at least put some cars in there and then I do have stuff that's 3D printed as well. I'll show you guys in another video. Some of you guys have already seen it, the live videos and stuff. But anyway, I want to kind of give you that insight. So I appreciate you guys watching. Definitely leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think of this project. Yeah, throw some ideas if you want to as well. Maybe you have something like, hey man, um, I got such and such or whatever. Hey, I'd like to send it to you or whatever. You know, or ideas. It's all good. So yeah, hit me up. Let me know. All right, you guys take care. Definitely appreciate all the support. Catch you on the next video real soon. Thank you again. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Peace. So here is the floor. Came out pretty good.